all right guys welcome back to this video um this is actually you know video that's been really hard for me to make and been wanting to get this off my chest for a while but recently there's been like a, a big switch up in my life and you know things have been kind of going downhill um and i told you guys i was doing this show but unfortunately we're gonna have to cancel this plan so uh, a lot of unfortunate circumstances came about in my life and you know i just had to put my mind into other things in life that are more important right now and kind of put this competing dream aside and overall you know working out and stuff i think i'm going to be taking a little bit of the excursion from posting and content and everything related to that so gonna be going off the grid and uh i just appreciate everyone who supported me on this amazing journey in this run but yeah we're gonna be going off the grid to motherfucking Houston! Let's go! <laughs> We're going to fucking Houston, baby! Alright, sorry about that, guys. I had to I had to hit you guys with that prank really quick. We're fucking moving to Houston, me and this motherfucker right here. <laughs> I'm not quitting bodybuilding, and I'm getting this motherfucking journey just started up. So get ready for the rest of this motherfucking prep series, because it's about to be two times as good. We're getting out of this fucking bitch-ass trench of a hole of Michigan right now. It's literally raining and fucking snowing all the time. It's the most bipolar shit I've ever seen in my entire life. But guess what? We're moving to fucking Texas, so content's gonna be out of this fucking world, and we're gonna be going to Alpha Land. The content's gonna be fucking amazing. I'm gonna be living with Dima. We're, uh, we're moving into, like, this pretty nice apartment. It's got, like, a pool. We got a hot tub there. It's year-round fucking warm weather, which is something that we have never experienced, because, you know, being in Michigan this cold nine months of the year. We're really anticipating this shit. We're really excited for this. It's one of the biggest moves I've ever made in my life. I've never lived anywhere else or like even lived outside of Michigan. So really fucking excited for this. I'm like, there's so much to come. Also guys, peep this. We got the new tattoo. I don't know if you can see like the details and shit on it, but it's got like a lot of like the fucking cream on it because it's like when you get a tattoo, you have to keep reapplying aquifer which is like a lotion, and if you don't, the tattoo will flake, and it'll dry out, and you'll like lose all the layers of skin, and you could permanently ruin your tattoo. So it's important to always keep it lubed up, you know? Gotta keep it lubed up, but anyways, you guys that are inexperienced wouldn't know that, would you? So we're going to go to the gym right now. We're going in for like a workout. I think I'm gonna be hitting shoulder say, and this is like one of the final workouts in the gym that I'm doing here. So, oh, it's going to be fucking weird. You know, like, Michigan, this is the end for it. It's the end of our fucking era. Shit's really going to take a turn. Um, It was always hard for us to po post these YouTube videos because we live so far away. Dima actually lives like 40 minutes away from me. And all the gyms that we meet up at are like 30 to an hour away. So it's like, you know, if he has something going on that day, he has to schedule his whole day around just filming and like, you know, content in general. So like being in the same apartment together and like i'm gonna be like yo demo pick up the camera really quick and the videos will be so much better because he's right there so it's like if i'm making some food and i want to say something to the camera i'm not gonna have to like vlog it it's, it's gonna be really fucking easy to produce this content and then being in like a content environment with like a bunch of content creators at alpha line i'm gonna be pumping out like i would say like two or three times as much content as i normally would especially on tiktok i'm gonna start you know posting a lot of tiktok and uh youtube as well so you guys are about to see some fucking banging this content. I'm really excited for it. This is probably going to be the most shredded I've ever been in my life because I'm like 12 weeks out or not even. I'm like 13 weeks out and I've got like full on six pack and lean as fuck, dude. Like you can even see it in my face. My face is already small and that usually doesn't happen until I'm like seven weeks out. So I would say like comparative to last year, I look like the same right now as I did about seven and a half weeks out last year. So I would say I'm like four or five weeks ahead of where I was at. Big things to come. Here we go. We're about to fucking smash this shit right now. Back in it, baby, just stay in a town. I'm on the edge, I ain't coming down. I get too high, I'm afraid of the ground. I'm young and I'm paid to play with these sounds. Ignoring the call, she's shedding that gown. Started a top and I'm taking it down off the champagne. Took a break from the brown on a rampage. I've been giving it brown. Shotty been solid some time now. I'm my life for the wine, dying and I'm with it. Look where we started and look where we at. I can see where we had it, but I can't see me finish. Three years ago, I was down on my last. Fuck this way. 245 isn't shit. Come on. It's fake. It's not real. This shit's pretend, man. You make your reality. Lift that shit. Stuck at the crib. I couldn't get out of my bed. Then I realized it's all in my head. And I can't go back to the past. Yeah. What's up now? I'm moving. Put all in the music for more like a movement is brewing. I cannot picture us losing. I'm sharp when I shoot it. The world is my tutor. She want to lip lock in public, but know that I'm published. We settle for safety. Not in the street, but I'm on the same muscle that schedule. Been driving her crazy. They talk like they know me, but know that they bluffing unless it's somebody that pays me. Keep minding your business, the money been printing. My nigga just gotta go get it. 
I'm in the zone through the winter. I'm trying to see Rome's he Venice. New drop, giving you guys a little bit of an update on what's to come. It's about middle way through the month, so we got like a few more days before it launches, but we got these new white beaters, which, you know, they don't call them white beaters on Young Galay. They call them, I think, what is it, white lovers or some shit? I don't know. I call them white beaters because that's in, in the trenches. We call them that. But anyways, check them out. They got Young Galay on the back. Super tight fitted around the waist. Honestly, I got a size XL, a little bit too small for me. I might have to do a double X. So if you guys want like a bigger size, I would, I would honestly size up maybe one or two, one for these. Uh, they say, or like Gary, the owner said that he doesn't want you to size up, but I had a hard time squeezing in this thing. So I would say that if you want to, you know, put yourself in the washing machine and dry it, and if you're expecting it to shrink, I would size up if I were you. But we got that, we got these shorts coming out. Pretty clean shorts, honestly, very comfortable. Um, a little bit loose, actually, so if you want a tighter fit, size down on these ones. I got a size large, and I don't know if my legs are getting smaller or what's going on, but I usually fill out shorts, and these ones are a little bit looser. It could just be the style, though. And then, last but not least, we got the hats. It's got the Young LA signature at the top, and yo, these are actually pretty fucking sick. I think I got one in like red, blue, and black, but they got like all these colors dropping, and the colors are sick for these. The hats always sell out, so make sure you guys get on that. Use code Zach at checkout for 15% off to save you. And yeah, appreciate all your support on all the Young LA stuff. You guys are the reason why I'm doing what I'm doing. Going to Houston because of you motherfuckers, so thank you. Love you all. I'm at the summit, I'm dumbing my budget, my nigga. It's nothing, just part of my I mean, a minute. I know they live it, admit it, I'm teed up Lil' baby, she a teaser Tell her to follow the leader I put that weight on my shoulder So let's run up the check in my DJ Really not nobody will it Feel like the stars in line and you can see it yeah. Alright, yo, so I'm introducing our new roommate Oh, sorry, I'm used, to, I'm used to my camera Where you have to like Talk to it and scream into the mic Because my mic's broken on my camera But Dima's camera has like, you know Perfect audio So I gotta get used to standing COVID distance from the camera. There you go. But anyways, this is my new roommate right here, Christian. Good boys, how y'all doing? You know, we coming in that bitch, we're grinding. You know, Alpha Land, here we fucking come. Let's get that shit, boy. Yes, sir. So yeah, Christian's like, he's just like getting in the fitness and shit. Gonna be training them, turning them to like an animal. And you know, he's got like a really fucking big heart for bodybuilding, so I'm excited to see where we can take it. And like, he's on my coaching shit right now, so we're gonna do like a little experiment and see how big he can get in the next six months. But he'll be living with us, and you're gonna see him in a lot of the videos he's gonna be like one of the main characters you know so yeah just had to get a little introduction look how aesthetic just see the potential right now i could see it bro like it's like dude it's just like the shoulders and the way like his muscle belly sit you can just see like if he gets any size at all it's gonna to show a, i can't wait to hit a pose like this be like, well, i mean you don't, you don't act like you're surfing bro you gotta like relax that shit <laughs> bro looks like he's surfing <laughs> Bro, we're on the fucking way, bro. This guy, he's up next. He's up next, bro. I'm up next. Let's fucking go, bro. Let's let's get to this fucking. What you got? Look at a drip. Niggas is lit. I've been on ten. I've been on ten. I'm active. Yeah, yeah. Slide that thing. Tell him to step back, cause I'm out of their range. I'm back in the game. Yeah, I'm active again. Yeah. Niggas is jaded. They tangling feelings. I'm on a wave. I know that they hate it. Prices to high. Ain't nobody really. Keep it cautious, no cash at the crib, everything been legit I keep it solid, I know they gon' talk when I get it They claim they're part of this shit, but I'm dolo with it, bitch I'm chasing the riches, the riders, the hell married to the Benjamins Niggas is mad, they're cynical They hate in your heart, waste your energy They want what we on, they envy, don't pay No mind, too focused on enemy My soul, she pure to have enemies So I hope you can find you some inner peace I need a minute, I know they live it, admit it I'm teed up, little baby, she a t all right, so right as we left, we found the golden lighting in here, and we didn't even know that this existed, but like this is literally stage lighting right here. This is like what you would want if you're doing a, body, a bodybuilding show. It's like a nice low light that's like perfect down lighting on your physique. It makes everything pop so much harder, and you can just see like all the details better. So we just found that shit, unfortunately, as we're about to leave. But anyways, this is the current condition and shape I'm in right now. Comparative to like 12 and a half weeks out last year, I was completely obese compared to this. Like this is so much leaner than I've ever been 12 and a half weeks out, which is why I think I'm gonna be the most shredded I've ever been in my entire life this year. Cause like, I've never started this lean. I'm really excited to see like where we can push the conditioning 
and I'm looking pretty full too, so I'm excited about that. Yeah, I gotta do a lot of posing when we get to Alpha Land. I'm gonna be in the posing room for hours. Just trying to figure out, you know, my routine and making sure I'm hitting all the poses right. So, classic physique is a big switch this year. I'm not looking to win it necessarily. I'm just like, I'm looking to win physique for sure because I just I feel like I'm an IPB pro uh, with my upper body. Like this is definitely a pro for, for men's physique. My like leg development is getting better. I don't know if it's there yet for a pro card, but. I'm gonna get conditioned as possible and try to get that pro card anyway, so that's what we're gonna do this year. Maybe I'll be able to bring in such good conditioning that my legs look more developed than they are. And then I guess after this this season, we're gonna be training legs hard as fuck. Like, I'm gonna try to start training them every like three to four days, just so that you know I can get bigger legs for the years to come. And yeah, the journey's just getting started, man. I'm like a young guy, just going for my dreams. So I'm excited for Houston. I'm gonna be the first one that's going down there, and Dima and Christian are gonna come after me. And I'm gonna get just adjusted to the gym, just to our place. Dude, we got big fucking things coming. I'm gonna, I'm thinking about starting the podcast and I'm gonna get like creators to start it with, just kind of wrapping up who I wanna do this with. But it's something I've always wanted to do for a long time and it feels good to finally be able to do the things that I could never do before just because I was in the wrong environment. So yeah, feeling really fucking good. Thank you guys for all the support on Young LA, Gorilla Mine. If you guys ever use code Zach, make sure you send me a screenshot of your purchase and I'm greatly appreciative of all your guys' support. You guys are allowing me to do like all this stuff like moving to Texas and like basically becoming the best bodybuilder I could possibly become and it's, it inspires me to have that amazing support from you guys so I love you and thank you guys all for everything you guys you know do when it comes to using my codes or like even just like liking my pictures on Instagram. It truly means a lot because you know everything helps so. I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button down below. And this year's gonna be fucking exciting. That's, that's where I'm gonna end this video at.